All right, so what we're going to look at is something called, um, it's, it's live paint using it in a way where you can kind of cut some things that you have in excess, which sounds kind of weird as far as using live paint. It's kind of like a hack to use live paint, but I think it's really great. So if I have this brush here like this, right, and I've drawn this shape here, but I really don't want all these other ends. I've drawn this quite sloppily. I just want this like kind of window that I created here. What I'm going to do is has to work with shapes and not um, as a line segment or um, a stroke. So I need to convert that, right? So we're going to go object, expand appearance. And then I'm going to go object, live paint, make. And then I'm going to go object, live paint, expand. And then I'm going to ungroup. And what this now will allow me to do is it should allow me to select, oops, select these little parts that extend over top. And what I have now is a really kind of express, expressively drawn object that I normally wouldn't have gotten um, maybe just by drawing that and I have to, would have to be really precise. So that works really well, uh, really great in a lot of different things that, that you can do with that, especially kind of with drawing. So let's say we're drawing something like this. Right, and I just wanted that original shape here. Again, select that, go object, expand appearance, object, live paint, make, object, live paint, expand, ungroup, command shift G, and now I can now deselect it. So now I have this, this really kind of organic shape that's here. You know, what we could do is in our Pathfinder, just expand that. And now you have your shape. Let's say you wanted it as, as a stroke. There it is. And now you've created that real easily using just a couple brush lines um, with that. Someone once asked me, could I do that with, let's just get a bigger weight line. If I just did some lines, could I get that same effect? Right, so object, expand appearance. Let's make sure that is totally expanded is object, uh, live paint, make, object, live paint, expand, ungroup. And there is my mark. So it is really useful in lots of different ways to be able to use that. Um, so just kind of think about that as you're maybe drawing or maybe kind of using something. You can get these really kind of manipulated lines um, just using that. It's the same idea if I kind of just did, like even let's just use some random shapes here, right? Something kind of unplanned, object, expand appearance, object, live paint make, object, live paint, Expand, ungroup. And you can see all these little bits here that maybe I didn't want. Even took that little one are now deleted. And now I have this, you know, maybe this is interesting. Maybe it isn't. Let's cut that off. Let's cut that piece off. Uh, right, if I wanted something like that or like that. And now I have this really unique shape kind of from just some random drawings or random line marks that I had. So really great for that idea. So think about that the next time you're kind of drawing shapes and symbols as well as illustrations.